friends, believe it or not, this Sunday, International Handstand Day. So whether you are a gymnast or into yoga, just want to have fun. Jackie Danker has handstand tips to turn our bodies and frowns upside down. Have there ever been things that you wanted to do, but your nerves just wouldn't let you? I've always wanted to do a handstand, and okay. I can't. <sighs> Everybody can. You okay. have to learn the technique and you have to build the strength. To learn some exercises and techniques so we can finally flip that can't into a can, we turn to personal trainer and founder of Train Like a Gymnast, Danielle Gray. Starting with inchworms. Your feet are glued together, your knees are straight. You're yep. gonna try to keep your legs straight as best you can as you reach for the ground. Then walk it out to a plank pose. Then walk your hands back in towards your feet, keeping those legs as straight as you can. Whoa! Yeah, feel that stretch. Do these until you're nice and warmed up. So you're just saying hello to your muscles. Hello, this muscles. Is, <laughs> this is practicing <laughs> getting that weight into your hands. Good. Okay. Next up, dinosaur kicks. Hands are down. One foot, usually your stronger leg is in front. Make sure your shoulders are stacked over your wrist. Lift your back leg up just a little and... You're gonna push through this bottom toe and try to get that leg off the ground. Okay. She says these will get our bodies used to lifting our leg and distributing the weight in our hands. Woo! Yeah. Try I feel there's so many muscles activating yes. right now. So this one you can do about 10 each side. Moving along with a jump to tuck handstand. Both hands down, shoulders are stacked over the wrist. Both feet are together, and for this exercise, we're just trying to think about getting our hips over our shoulders. Whoa. Look in between your hands and jump your legs up and then come back down. Almost like a donkey kick. She says try and do about 10 of these, rest, and do 10 more. Whoa. Longer. Yeah. <laughs> And our final step before liftoff is handstand conditioning. Find that elevated surface. Which can be the back of a couch or a chair and prop your knees onto it. You're gonna feel like, okay, I'm practicing a handstand, but you're just in a tuck position. I'm practicing all my blood going to my head. Yes, exactly. Hold in that position for up to 30 seconds and then lift one leg up at a time. You're just trying to work on your stability here, keeping your eyes in between your hands. Oh my goodness. Now let's put it all together. Dinosaur kick and up. Oh my goodness. Pull your ribs in. That's you. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Flipping out because now we know how to do a handstand.